This video shows American Artillery Tractor's Holt 5-ton Artillery Tractor Model 1917-T11, which participate in actions to support the issue of Liberty Bonds. These shows took place in various U.S. cities in the fall of 1918. Tractors tow a British 8-inch Mark 6 to 8 howitzer and a French 155mm Falu gun of the 1917 model along the streets of Richmond, Detroit, Philadelphia, New York, and several other cities. The video also features a Holt 10-ton Model 55 artillery tractor as well as U.S. Army military trucks, FWD Model B, FWD Model G with Spotlight and Class B standardized military truck, Liberty Truck. Liberty Bond is a debt obligation issued by the U.S. Department of the Treasury in conjunction with the Federal Reserve. Also known as a Liberty Loan, it was a war bond issued in four installments in 1917 to 1918 as a means to finance the U.S. participation in World War I and the Allied war effort in Europe. Liberty Bonds were launched by an act of Congress known as the Liberty Bond Act. With this program, Americans basically loan the government money to help pay for the costs of wartime military operations. After a certain number of years, those who invested in these bonds would receive their money back, plus interest. However, Liberty Bonds were only moderately successful when first issued in April 1917 to the embarrassment of the Treasury Department. The government, to ensure the bonds were more successful the next time, organized a massive public awareness campaign. The first issue of Liberty Bonds offered an interest rate of 3.5%, which was lower than that available through a typical savings account at that time. Over the course of several subsequent releases, the interest rate gradually increased slightly up to 4.25%. Bonds were available in denominations as low as $50. They could also be bought in installments via 25-cent war thrift stamps and $5 war savings certificates, which eventually could be turned in for an actual Liberty Bond. Liberty Bonds offered many ordinary Americans their first experience with investing. Up to then, securities were seen as something for the very rich or professional Wall Street traders.